We've been taking you all across the state. So what's it like in New Haven right now? Yeah, let's get right out to Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Marcy Jones, who is live there this morning with more on the closures and the road conditions. Hey, Marcy, how's it going out there? Hey, Kate and Kara, it's good. I'll tell you how it is. It's messy, messy, messy. Come with me for a little walk about. We've got about, I would say, maybe two to three inches out here right now. The roads are still, take a look. This is uh, right on Orange Street. It's still, it's still pretty built up here. You know, we've been seeing the plows and the salt trucks going through. They're really trying their hardest. But as we've been talking about all morning, the amount that this is coming down, the quickness of the clip, it really is piling up fast. So if you don't have to get out, don't definitely stay at home. And here's the sad reality of this. We've already heard about several accidents so far. Take a listen to we've got New Haven Fire Chief. We just spoke with him, John Alston. He said stay off the roads if you can. We've already had a few minor car accidents. People are still driving at the same speeds that they always do, not really respecting the roads or the intersections. So what's happening is they think they can stop and they can't. We just ask you if you can stay home, stay home, let the plows do their work. And also if you are gonna travel, you actually have to, please reduce your speed and give respect to the cars in front of you and the intersections. Now we know a lot of activities and scheduled events were canceled or delayed, so we've got no school today. Tweed is shut down. Senior centers are not open, so definitely stay at home if you can. Warming centers have extended their hours through 7 a.m. tomorrow morning, so if you are so inclined, you're more than welcome to go and warm up. Reporting live in New Haven, Marcy Jones, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. All right, some good advice there, Marcy. Of course, it is a